um, these are my ideas of how um, we can put together uh, presentations and um, things to think about in PowerPoint. Just as a student, I've learned these little tricks over the, over the years, so I'll just share them with you. First of all, we have a title page, and this is where you'll um, put your main idea, kind of title your innovation, and you also want to put your name on it so that the presenters are for sure know who you are and they can um, score you correctly or the judges. Um, the first page would be, you, you really, it's your first impression of your idea. How is, uh, how are you going to be presenting? What are you going to be talking about? And you want to grab their attention. Um, keep your font size bigger than 30 so that people can read it and it's clear and it doesn't get over, cl over cluttered. Um, keep in mind that for a 10 minute presentation you should have approximately 10 to 12 slides. Uh, unless you're going to be spending more time on certain subjects you don't want to get more than 10 slides, um, just to keep it, keep it really tight. On the next slide, you might want to develop your idea using more detail. Um, use photos and other visuals. Uh, you'll see from other presentations as you're watching them, you can really see how having a photo of what you're talking about really helps the, the listener to understand what you're talking about and kind of visualize it. And it also helps you to express it a little easier. Um, so try to keep the visuals under two per slide. You don't want to get it too cluttered. Uh, you could have more if it was very effective, but uh, you want to keep them so your slides look nice and clean. You want to look at who your consumers are going to be because we want this to be, you know, your, your innovation to be something that's going to be used. And that's one of the things that the judges are going to be looking for. So you want to look at who your consumers are and how you're going to reach them. You don't really want to make yourself look less effective by showing your competitions, but to show that you're aware of who's out there and what similar products or services or uh, innovations, shall we say, are, are currently out there is really important. You want to maybe list your leading competitor. And you should also look deeper into the um, idea of competition because there are lots of um, indirect, direct competition that's out there that would cause uh, people to, to choose to use a different product other than your own. Uh, your marketability, that's you know really looking at what you have and who's in your market, how are you going to sell it, how are you going to secure funding, um, create, are you going to create a small business, you want to kind of describe what, what, your, what your idea for marketing your product. And then you want to give a conclusion. Um, you can, um, you, you know, use photos or graphics or just, you know, kind of say your final thoughts and, and leave that kind of lasting impression with, you, with the judges. And um, you want to ask if, if they have questions. You may not include a question slide, but um, to make sure that you ask so that there can be a dialogue there if necessary. Do you guys have any questions?